who is your success up to? Yeah. Who can stop you from doing anything you want to do? Nobody. Nobody, right? Oh. So you got to take that responsibility on yourself and make sure you put in the time, the energy, and the effort into making that happen. So I said, I was talking about how you see yourself. Anybody know who that is? All right. Has anybody seen any videos of Michael Jordan when they won, when he won championships? If you ever pull up a video of Michael Jordan when he won a championship, when he won the first championship, he, he won his first one. When he was celebrating, you know, you know what the first thing he did was? He held up the number two. Because he said, I got one, now I'm going after number two. He saw himself as a champion. That was one of his biggest strengths. Even when he was losing, he saw himself as a champion. Every single time Michael Jordan won a championship, pull up some YouTube videos, you'll see. When he's celebrating in the, in the aftermath in the, on the court, he holding up that next number. When he got two, he held up three. When he got four, he held up five because he saw himself as a champion. And that's what you have to do. You have to see yourself as what you want to be and then start mapping out your plan. Planning is so important. A lot of people end up failing because they're not prepared and they don't have a plan. When it comes to anything in life, when it comes to finances, when it comes to business, when it comes to school, everything is all about planning, right? You know, like I said, I didn't have people coming out to my school teaching me stuff, telling me stuff, for example. So when I got to college, I had never had a finance class, but I was in real time. I had to manage my money. So it was a lot of mistakes I made. Why? Because I wasn't prepared. I, wasn't, I didn't know how to budget. I didn't know how to use a credit card. I didn't know a lot of things. But when you see yourself as success and you put the plan together, then you're able to map stuff out. I mean, we're in the information age. All the information you want to get is there. Anything you want to know is there. So if you choose not to get it, if you choose not to look it up, that's on you. You can't blame anybody else for that failure, right? So whatever you want to do, if you want to be an athlete, you got to look up the, what, what are the best athletes doing? How are the best athlete, athletes working out? How are the best athletes eating? What are the most successful entrepreneurs doing, right? Down to the most finite detail, right? If you, are, if you want to be a successful entrepreneur, I'll be trying to find out what time, what time are these guys waking up in the morning. What, 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 does, what does their day look like on an everyday basis? What are they doing? What are they reading? You know, what are they doing? It, it's not, most people think success is just like an overnight boom. You just, you just hit it big, right? Even some of the most successful people that you may know now, for example, Steve uh, who? Steve Harvey. Dude's been through a lot. He's been homeless. He's been, he's, you know, he's been through relationship trouble, financial trouble. But the key, he never stopped working. He saw himself as a success, right? And another key, too, is who you surround yourself with. He told a story about when he met his wife and how she totally changed his image, right? And how he, he said a lot of opportunities that he has now is because his wife helped him change his image to be somebody that's more marketable in this time. So you also got to look at the people who you're hanging around, right? If you want to go to college, you can't be hanging around with people that don't plan on going to college. You can't be hanging around with people that's, you know, getting in trouble every day, not doing their schoolwork because all they're doing is holding you back. You want to surround yourself with people that are going to help you get to where you want to get to. They, that, that are going to help you get to the next level. When 